Hey y'all, how y'all doing? Please know that everything said in this video is alleged and it's my very own personal opinion. <sighs> hey Wanda, how does it feel to be getting ready to get sued by two people at the same damn time? That's what the fuck you get, okay? Because you have been given multiple chances to sit down and shut up, okay? You dedicated a whole life to talking shit about me and Mel the other day, doing nothing but spreading lies. And you will pay in court. Know that. And I know that you think somebody playing with you, but this is not a game, okay? You said that it's your channel. And you will say whatever the fuck you want to say. But that's where you're wrong. You can't get on your channel and make up lies, Barracuda. Because when you do, that's called defamation. And that leads to lawsuits like the ones you're about to have on your ass. It baffles me as to how Letitia and Stormy feel like Mel can control a sea full of people she don't even know. But they can't control their lying ass, trifling ass, too old for the bullshit ass mamas. Because I saw Petty Betty, ugly ass in Wanda's chat. And I told her ass, okay, that she was trash and so was her fucking daughter. Y'all, Wanda got her slow ass online telling people that Miss Black Titanic is my mother. And people running with that shit and are now saying that me and Miss Black Titanic out here scamming. Lies are also being spread about me being cousins with Mel and Mel's mama van. Those are lies as well. In no way am I related to Miss Black Titanic, Van, or Mel. Just a couple of weeks ago, you had somebody else saying I was out here doing shady shit and working with Anonymous and had a mental illness, paranoia, and all that other shit. Everybody will be handled in the court of law, and I'm not playing with nobody because what the fuck y'all not going to do is keep playing with me and throwing bullshit on my name. So good luck to all parties involved proving what the fuck y'all said about me online in front of thousands of people, good luck proving that shit in court in front of the judge. Okay? Y'all have caused me to lose subscribers. Y'all got folks thinking I'm scamming. Okay? Y'all have done some damage. I'm one of the most legit bitches you gonna ever encounter in your life. That being said, I will see you hoes in court. Okay? I'm lining y'all motherfuckers up and gonna make examples out of y'all asses. You can remove videos, edit videos, do what you want, but it ain't going to help y'all because I have the originals. Please believe me, okay? And Wanda, you so fucking dumb, you fell right into my trap. You got on that live the other day saying you wasn't going to call names. I got into your chat and said you ain't going to call no names because your motherfucking ass going to get sued. So you started calling names and now your ass is about to get sued. Ha ha, ha ha, bitch. For those of you who sent me your information regarding your orders from Stormy, I haven't forgotten about y'all, okay? I haven't forgotten about y'all. Somebody purposely tried to throw a monkey wrench in the middle of my efforts to try to get y'all justice, but I'm back focused and will be working on that shit all week. If I have to sleep in my office, I will, okay? When I tell y'all I'm drained, I'm working. I'm trying to produce content, fighting these retarded ass people from the show. Okay? Because they are public figures and don't want to be talked about and other shit. But out here running their mouth and lying on people. Just fucking ridiculous. But it's all going to be well worth it because in the end, all you motherfuckers going to know that everybody ain't going to play with y'all. Okay? Y'all so thirsty to dock somebody. Y'all so thirsty to say, I know who she is. I know who she is. Y'all don't know shit. Whenever somebody says something about y'all asses y'all don't like, which be the motherfucking truth, y'all run to the internet talking about her name is this, her address is that. And y'all sound so fucking stupid doing that shit. Because for one, y'all ass is going to get sued because doxing is a crime. Ain't going to get your motherfucking ass thrown in jail. Just ask the dumb bitch over there that's currently getting sued for $10 million. The one who likes to partake in investigations and spread her bullshit ass theories on her whack ass channel. This is the season of lawsuits. And I can't stress that enough. Even Mel is gearing up to sue Wanda. And it's been long overdue. 
I've been saying male need to sue these motherfuckers, but people got to do what they going to do when they feel that they need to do it. Male been sitting back hoping these motherfuckers would just shut up and go about their business, okay? But I knew that shit wasn't going to happen. Because if you let people keep playing with you, that's what they're going to do. They are all prime examples of that. Ariane has been lying on Mel for years. And her lies stem from the lies that Martel told her about Mel, okay? All the lies stem from Martel. Even Betty done lied on Mel. Didn't Betty call Mel a hoe? All they sorry asses was over there assassinating her character. And then when she didn't respond to that, they tried to go after her business. Like Wanda tried to do the other night. Tater had ugly ass had the nerve to insinuate that male shit was white label. Only to end up allegedly selling white label ass bullshit over there on TikTok. Mel done been every whole terrible mother. They said she was still fucking Martell. They said that she was paying me and other content creators to attack them. Okay? Motherfuckers done said all types of shit. Some shit I didn't even bother repeating because it's clown shit. One thing hateful and jealous ass motherfuckers gonna do is lie on you to try to change people's perceptions of you. Okay? Everybody on that show is jealous of male. Okay? Even them bitches, mamas, okay? Them bitches, mamas hate male. Tater head mama and Tisha head mama both jealous as fuck of male. Okay, if Mel was so bad, then why the fuck are they daughters trying to mimic every single thing she fucking does? Whether it's the color wig she wears, the style, her, you know, her, her verbiage, workouts, the packing her orders. You know what I'm saying? The packing of her orders on live, selling t-shirts. You can't tell me that those fucking clowns don't have their notifications on to let them know when Mel is online. Every time Mel do something, here they go. Every time Mel do something. Especially they go stormy trying to do the exact same thing, but can never get it right, which is why her ugly ass be out here mad. Then she gonna pull her unfortunate ass son in it, y'all. Stormy gonna pull her unfortunate ass son in it. I guess she didn't want to get dragged by herself, so she done pulled her son into the mess. Her big face, where's Waldo looking ass, gonna say that her two year old son, or however old he is, she gonna say that her son said that they not like us what i wanted to do was email his little ass and say i know we not like y'all because we not getting sued the fuck about our socks and big ass glasses that would be your bad business doing big face ugly trifling ass mama little boy okay she know damn well that little boy didn't say that shit that was all her he didn't say that shit though all her and her ignorant ass mama going to say, I've taught them well. I've taught him well. This was over on Facebook, y'all. I said, bitch, you ain't taught nobody shit, especially your daughter. She's the dumb bitch that she is today because you ain't taught her how to do nothing but hate those that are more successful than her ass. In my opinion, both of these slow asses hate a woman that ain't done shit to them but give their asses an opportunity to be seen on a large platform instead of being grateful, they wanted to attack the person who helped them instead, okay? Which is why this is probably going to be their last fucking season on there. Wanda, I know you had hopes of getting back on the show, but like I told your ass in the chat the other day, you're not getting back on the show, so you might as well just move the fuck on. You should have been, you should have been moved the fuck on, but you chose to stick around and come after mail, and now look, what has happened? You out here lying on her ass, and now her ass about to sue your ass, okay? In the blink of an eye, Mel had popped up on her live, not only dragging the shit out of your ass, but let you know that she was getting ready to sue your ass, okay? Said documents was going to be filed expeditiously. You could have went and sat your ass down somewhere and played bingo or some shit, but no. You wanted to take your ass outside and get on your live next to that broken down, lonely ass, purple ass, Barney ass food truck in your raggedy ass yard, bitch. Bitch, you calling us lonely? No, that would be that fucking out of service ass wagon you got in your yard. Okay? Bitch, your daughter lonely. Because even though she married, she's a single parent. She even said that shit herself. Okay? Now, let's get on what Mel said about your drunk ass. And you know me, I'm going to remix the shit. True T style, okay? So pretty much Mel was over there in her second home. You know, the one I think 
she's uh paid for with cash yeah that one she was over there in her camouflage attire y'all ready for war bitch what it all boils down to is that she's suing your ass wanda okay she said life is short she said half of your shit is already over she said half your shit is already over with okay and instead of doing something productive with your time you choose to get your syrup lady looking ass on social media and come for a woman that's young enough to be your daughter she said you're embarrassing as fuck wanda okay as a mother as a daughter as a grandmother and whatever else you are she said you and her ain't the same and she started showing footage of her second home okay to shut your ass the fuck up she said y'all not the same especially when it comes to the money she said your crack lip ass need to do something other than steal and get your ass online being stupid making up lies and that goes for you too marcella who i believe she is gonna sue as well as she should because i heard with my own ears marcella you tell people that males ass and titties were fake now y'all gonna have to come into court and prove that so good luck and Mel said that she wants something for every lie wanda you know how many lies your ass and told and you keep saying you only come for folks after they come for you and you a fucking lie because we all know Mel nor myself was saying anything to your ass but you kept running your mouth let's see if you run it now because regardless of what you think ain't nobody playing with your ass you play too damn much you over there talking about how we sit on our ass all day behind the computer we sit on our asses uh, creating content and getting paid for the shit while you sit on your funky ass all day and lie okay and ain't even getting paid for the shit your whack ass channel ain't even monetized you're basically over there running your mouth for free you shouldn't get paid no way because you ain't saying shit so you're not getting paid from your channel and now you're about to have to pay for every fucking lie your cantaloupe head ass and told on that lady okay mel said and not even just that lady because bitch i'm coming for your ass too please believe that i'm busy right now but baby when i get done i'm coming okay with them papers mel said you gonna have to pay me little wanda ain't nothing about your ass little but i think it's safe to say that she was saying your ass ain't nobody you are highly irrelevant which makes you little wanda and you have a childlike mindset so yeah bitch we're gonna call your ass little wanda and sit your ass right next to little buddy mill said little wanda grow the fuck up little <laughs> <laughs> wanda grow the fuck up who the fuck has a husband and a motherfucking boyfriend but you and a crew out here calling mill a hoe mill said bitch you a hoe always been a hoe and i ain't detect not one line all i detected was multiple baby daddies wanda can you please confirm that wanda if you have multiple baby daddies and had your babies before you were an adult you have no room to call nobody a hoe mill said bitch don't ever get to thinking that just because i sit over here and mind my business drink water and make my money that you can play with me she said i make my money so i can deal with bitches like you and trust you're gonna be dealt with she sent a mass message out to all y'all sorry asses out there who think that y'all can just pull lies about y'all funky asses and tell them to the people just because folks think more highly of her than they do y'all dusty trifling criminalistic asses okay and i guess you call male whack but baby she said the only thing whack is your eco style gel ass hairdo okay and that raggedy ass food truck and that shit you be over there calling food some shit i bet you a dog wouldn't even eat but you got your ass over there talking about her skincare line i bet you a dog would eat her skincare line before they ate your food okay but anyway funny thing is mel said that she tried to have mercy on wanda because she was in an okay space with her daughter and her son-in-law but now she like fuck that and if she decide to how do i put it if she decide to look at 
this past week's episode. I'll say that. And I'm talking about Mel. If Mel decide to look at the episode that aired the other day, she going to definitely say fuck that. Because somebody said that Tisha said that Mel be telling the Melameters to activate. Like she don't be telling her motherfucking mama to activate and say all the things her ass ain't got the courage to say. She want Mel to control the Melameters, but can't control her Grand Canyon mouth ass mama. Tisha, take off them fucking Sunday service ass stockings you be wearing and shut the fuck up. Raise your hand when you want to speak and we'll decide if you can. How about that? Because there ain't nobody stutting your ass. Get your mama. But then again, it's too late. As for you, Wanda, Mel said you might as well take your non-talking ugly ass up to the courthouse because that's where it's all about to go down at because your ass is about to get served. She not playing with your razor blade cut lip ass, okay? That's what she said. Bitch, Mel done pulled your ass up by the edges and said, not today. Not me and not today. Your time is up. Y'all are done playing with me. Sir, y'all ass is right. Mel said she coming. She coming for you, little Wanda. And everything you got, because your big back barracuda looking ass been lying on her for years. Okay? You done playing with her. She done playing hungry, hungry hippo. She playing chess, okay? You want to run your mouth? Now she about to get with your ass. You done got used to her not saying shit. Now she about to say what she have to say in court to the judge. Okay? And sue the fuck out your ass. Mel said y'all done playing with her and her kids and her motherfucking business. She said ever since she said Tisha daddy be in her DMs, you had a problem with her. But she didn't lie about that. So she don't understand why you out here lying. And I agree. If you're going to try to take somebody down, at least do it with the facts. You know what I'm saying? Y'all motherfuckers just be out here straight lying and recruiting other motherfuckers to help y'all lie. That's sad and pathetic. Lawanda, Mel says she going to need you to prove all them lies you done told on her ass or run her her money, okay? She about to embarrass the shit out of you in court because she said your ass is just vile. Okay, and she going to play them takes for that judge. Okay? Just foul. No, she said you vow. But I'm going to add something to that shit. I told you I was going to remix it, okay? Bitch, you vow and you foul. Because can't nobody convince me that your ass don't stink. You come off as a type of bitch that stink while you saying everybody else stink. You come off as a type of bitch that know you stink. Okay? And so you go and spray a whole bottle of cheap-ass perfume over the funk. Mixed with tussy. Because you smell like badussy. Okay? And if you're a Bernie Mac fan, you know what the fuck that means. Lawanda, why your ugly ass... Missing top row T. George Jefferson looking ass son-in-law out here calling the millimeters brainless and deplorable. Y'all are the only motherfuckers we see who are brainless and deplorable, okay? Y'all are a fucking embarrassment. Mel said you are the fucking deplorable, okay? From what she can see. And she don't need no fucking binocular ass Coke bottle ass glasses like Stormy be wearing to see the shit, okay? It's clear as day, Okay? That you and the motherfuckers you roll with are deplorable. Terribly dressed, retarded, lying, broke ass deplorables, okay? Mel said your ass old enough to be Abraham Lincoln grandmama, bitch. And there your ass go trying to battle with somebody young enough to be your daughter. When your ass know better. She said that's why your challenged ass couldn't graduate from school because your ass is always in other people's business and not in yours. In everybody fucking business. In everybody fucking chat. But you broke. Okay? Sitting there looking like you filming a fucking horror scene with that abandoned ass food truck sitting in the yard, probably on two wheels, like Mel said. Where the other two wheels at, bitch? Since you know everything else, tell us that. Mel said, go get a GED. She said, go get a GED shit. <laughs> I said, well, damn. (laughs) But for entertainment purposes, okay. Mel, can you tell Wanda to spell GED before she go get it? (laughs) 
Because I'm almost positive she's going to get the shit wrong. <laughs> and I could be wrong. But I think Meryl let us know that a certain motherfucker was out here, uh, you know, talking about a lawsuit. Because, not, not uh, talking about it, but how do I put it? Was out here lying about a lawsuit? Because she said the only thing she been to court for was her kids. I know there was a blogger who mentioned he was suing her, even recorded himself walking from court, right? But where's the lawsuit? Mill ain't been to court for shit but her kids, she say. Now she about to go slap a defamation suit on Wanda and Marcella's ass. I bet you Marcella ain't over there talking about Mel today. I know after she said something about suing, Marcella started talking about fixing people's credit. <laughs> like Mel who? <laughs> Marcella don't want no part of that lawsuit. <laughs> That's what y'all get for lying. Because <laughs> you know, that don't even be bothering you, Marcella. Mel don't be bothering you, and I don't be bothering you. I had no desire to until I saw you over there talking about how I was saying shit about somebody, child. You and Wanda always getting caught up in messy shit. I didn't used to say shit about Wanda either until I call her ass over there talking shit about me as well. When I speak, I speak facts. When y'all speak, y'all speak lies. And ain't nobody about to sit still and let y'all lie on their asses. So both of y'all can get it and will because y'all not about to be out here lying on folks no more. Not on me, not on Mel. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know damn well I ain't Miss Black Titanic's daughter. Just be out here making up shit. Lil Wanda... Mel said, grow the fuck up or not. Either way, she going to get paid and she not playing with you. She going to holler at your ass in the courthouse. Okay. Who next? Now y'all, that's going to be all for this video. Y'all take care. <laughs> and I'll chat with y'all in the next one.